Hello. It's a beautiful Sunday. Guess where I'm at? Ways Garden, Williamsport, Pennsylvania. And uh, so far, remember the number of benches last week at Brandon Park? Nope. These gotta be. It's not polyester. Ooh. Different sounds. I'm in a cab caboose. No, a the thing where the flowers grow down. That's where I'm at. Could somebody tell me what this is? Because off the top of my head, I can't think of the word. It's those things you put on a building. It's art. It's artwork. It's a mural. That's a mural. It's two fish. Carp, carp, mural. I want to say, I, I like this. I mean, look at this. Look at this box. That's real wood. It's a foam flower. These right here, foam flower. Cardinal flower. These some red Colombian flowers. You guys feeling what I'm feeling? And look, there's leaves everywhere. Everywhere. Follow. Let's look, look at the leaf. You can feel the leaf now. How a leaf. Oh, in Maple Tree Heaven. I do recommend coming to this park. We are going to show you something sad later on. I don't know if it's sad, but we found somebody's home. So it's healing. I found the fountain of Williamsport. Just your normal fountain. And there's people here in this park today. Which makes me happy because we're usually the only ones here. And um, let's walk here and go see if Henry's home. I think his name's Henry. And if he is, we're gonna give him we're gonna give him some lunch money for Henry. Dollar, two dollars. We'll give him two dollars. That doesn't buy you much anymore. Always help people out because they will come back to return. Henry! Guess what we have? A question. I can go straight through the grass and go left through the path or right through the path. Which direction do you choose? Left. Good answer. Oh! I found something fascinating I have not seen before. Look at this barrel. Or jug. Tell me that's not the coolest thing you've ever seen. And there's something to hook it up to. You could probably fill this with grape juice. Maybe Snapple. If you have any. A land sport shed. A Williamsport parking lot. We're still on the left path. But here we're going to see if Henry's home. Getting closer. bed, his pillows, and his life. But he's not here today to help out, so we're going to keep on moving. Follow me. Don't it feel good just to skip once in a while? This park is actually small. But if you're into poetry, crocheting, and what do we see on the ground? A mosaic. 
If you're into them, this car's perfect for you. Let's all be quiet and recognize the bell. It stopped. <laughs> I got the worst loss of bells, let me tell you. Ooh, a platinum? Let's read this. It could be something historic. It's not. It's not. But here's DOC's grave. Doc's garden. These to me looks like a mulberry tree bush. I'm not sure. If anybody has a mulberry tree, let me know. Right, let's sneak up. Is it safe? A Wayne's Ford bench. Not as nice as the other Wayne's Ford bench. Maybe we'll find another. Follow me at the finish line to this car. And we're gonna show you what's across the street. Well, here's the entrance to Way's Garden. Like I said, it's a rock and it's old. We want to go check out the uh, train museum right across the street. So, if you're ever in Williamsport, I do recommend this museum. It's actually quite interesting. Follow me. I will be showing you how to cross the street properly. You don't play around when it comes to crossing streets. Now we're going to look to the left. On the right, and we're going to go. Now, did you see how I took my time there? This is the uh, Trinity Parish office. It's an old building. This is not the museum, by the way. But during the Little League Parade, they sell hot dogs right here. I bought one one year. 2017. I bought two hot dogs. Mustard. Relish. Old building. Old home. Let's go check the old home now. A no arm statue. Follow me. <gasps> Paul Bunyan. <laughs> We're out of the yard. That was scary. All right. Here's the museum I was telling you about. It's the Lycoming County Historical Museum. You got uh, old school satellite dishes. That's what they used to look like in the 1600s. There's three of them. And this is Paul Bunyan. Right Paul Bunyan. Grand Four Pennsylvania. And we're now at the Lycoming County Museum. And it is open. If I had more than two dollars, I'd go tell everybody what's inside, which maybe we can do this week. That would be so much fun. All right, we're gonna uh, take you to our next destination. See you when we get there. And now into the, uh, these used to be old homes. I think million dollar homes, 
back in the million dollar days. Look how big they are. These used to be one family home. So we're just gonna look at a couple. Call it a day until we go on a real trip. I like the color in this one. Kind of reminds me of a house you would see in Dominica. Don't get mixed up with Dominica Republic. You know there's four countries that begin with the letter D and Dominica's one. The other one's Dominican Republic, Denmark, and the final one from Africa, if you can name it before I do, Djibouti. That's right, four of them. Anyways, enough about that. <gasps> Purple flowers. I smell grapes. Seriously, I did a little. Uh, another house from the old school. I do believe that's a halfway house. Like, when you go to jail and you come out, they put them there and they all live together. It's for females. I'm not a female, so I never lived there. All right. As you can see, we're on Vine Ave. Vine Ave. We're not going to go down there, but we did find the landmark. A Venus Port Fire Hydrant. Put a like if you've seen one of these before. We got a green fence. A green book. And a green yard. We're going to take you over to the park and say our goodbyes. If there's any place you'd like me to show, advertise, just put it on the comments and I will do that for us all. Now remember the proper way of crossing the street. Left, right, straight. Now as you can see, they will be putting up a fence here. It's temporarily down. This pole connecting right here and a fence will go up. I used to put fences up when I was little. We're just going to walk down the street and probably call it a day. We're going to go home and make s'mores tonight. And uh, try to shoot some pumpkins with a pumpkin gun. Everybody here have a good night. And I will see you ooh, one last thing and look at this one. You don't see these too often. I believe that's for hummingbirds. Does anybody know what a hummingbird is? This is what they eat right here. Alright, well everybody, enjoy your night off. And I will see you tomorrow as we explore the top of that mountain. For all and all a good night.